welcome to the Carol of the Bells tutorial for violin, the simple version. When you go to the play along, you'll see the top video of me and the second from the top video of me playing both of these parts. They're both repeated through the whole piece. It's the little figure that happens throughout Carol of the Bells. So look at the music below. You have a choice of slurring the TTs or not. I like to slur them. And a slur is not written in, but you can add it or play around with the bowings. So this piece is in three, four time. And we're gonna sing the rhythm first. I'm gonna count to three, and then you're gonna come in on one. One, two, three. Ta, ti, ti, ta. Ta, ti, ti, ta. Ta, ti, ti, ta. Ta, ti, ti, ta. Since this piece has no sharps or flats, it's in the key of A minor, you are going to be playing a low two, which is a C natural. Let's sing the note names. C, B, C, A. C, B, C, A. C, B, C, A. C, B, C, A. Now, we're gonna sing the finger numbers. They remember this is a low two. One, two, three. Two, one, two, A. Now you can try playing it. One, two, three. Next, we're gonna le learn the part two, which has the same rhythm, but different notes. For the first note, I recommend using your fourth finger on A string so you don't have to use the open E and then cross over to A string. So since it's the same rhythm as the one before, we're gonna go right to singing the note names. One, two, three. E, D, E, C. E, D, E, C. E, D, E, C. E, D, E, C. Now we're going to sing the finger numbers. One, two, three. Four, three, four, two. Four, three, four, two. Four, three, four, two. Four, three, four, two. Remember that that two is still low because we are still in the same key even though it's a different part. Now let's go to playing it. One, two, Three. All right, enjoy the play along. 